where you're praying to God to rescue you. But my question, and I'm continuing from this morning, is are you a survivor or are you a believer? It's easy to take on a survivor's mentality and especially so in difficult times. The attitude that says, I just hope I can hold on and somehow get through this. Yeah. Can I survive this pandemic, these troubles, this season? Can I make it through? If you're just hoping you'll survive, the fate will somehow treat you kindly. They do not believe in God for supernatural increase and restoration like He wants you to believe. You see, there was a survivor and a believer went out fishing together and they got caught side on by a wave and their fishing boat was overturned. It was a survivor and a believer. Well, the survivor is just clinging to the boat, trying to hold on. And of course, if you're clinging to a boat, then your hands are pretty busy. There's not a whole lot you can do to extend yourself and reach out. The survivor is just clinging to the boat. The believer, he looks at the land. He thinks, I believe I can make the shore. And by the way, in real life, you'd wanna make sure that you really could make the shore before you let go of that boat. So the survivor's just clinging to the boat, but the believer, he thinks, I think I can make the shore. Uh, the survivor, he's full of fear and trembling because he's fearful that a shark was gonna eat him for dinner. But the believer, he's thinking, I believe I'll be home for dinner tonight. The survivor, not sure I can last, can I hold on? The believer, I'm committed that I will endure. Different spirit altogether. Where do you stand right now? Isaiah 42 verse 22.